Hello, I'm Simon Christie. And I'm Danny Sparks Cousins. Now Danny, some pretty tough looking trucks we've got here. They sure are Simon. This is our 80. And this is finally the 40 out on the tracks. Let's get these vehicles out and finally get to have a play. viewers, this is the 40, my beast, and what an awesome machine it is. Starting down at the bottom end here, we've got the massive 37-inch Maxxis Trepador tyres, and what an awesome off-road tyre they are. Procom alloys keep them locked to the axles, and of course, a set of front and rear ARB air lockers are the way to go. Suspension on this machine is a combination of EFS sleeves, experimental adjustable shock absorbers, and superior engineering shackles in the rear. This is an awesome combination, specific for my vehicle and the terrain I like to tackle. And whilst it's not the sort of suspension I'd like to be taking on a trip to the outback, the sorts of tracks we're doing today, it is absolutely amazing. Up the front there, we've got the ARB bull bar, loaded with a worn 9.5 Ti winch and a set of Narva spotlights. Powering this machine is a tight and noisy motor. We have a 5.7 litre stroke 308 motor that's running all of the good stuff. It's naturally aspirated. And an exhaust system from Ringwood, performance exhaust, certainly gives me that performance rumble turning out well over 300 horsepower at the flywheel. The guys from On Track 4 Driving Queensland did the paint, bodywork and built the six point roll cage. Now the paint job is something a little bit different. I've always liked to be one who stands out and I've gone for a reptile scale green and it certainly gets people's attention. On the inside, we're running a Waco CDF11 fridge freezer, the world's smallest fridge, in fact, and that's an awesome unit for a centre console between the two racing seats. Now, the guys at Oztops up in Queensland offered to make me a soft top, but I wanted it made to my specifications. Now, this soft top is actually what they're now selling as their standard soft top, so a great looking unit. My good mate Fester from All 4x4 Parts supplied plenty of spares. And I'd also like to put out a big thank you to Geelong Smash Repairs for finishing off the amazing clear coat. Viewers, this vehicle has unfortunately been off the road for around six years now, so I am just thrilled to be out in the tracks and driving it. I hope you've enjoyed seeing it go as much as I have. Let's now take a close look at Danny's vehicle. Well, regular viewers will realise that quite a lot of work's happened to our 80 since last series, starting with the paint and panel, which Geelong Smash Repairs kindly took care of. Up the front, we've got an ARV bull bar with a Tigers 11 two-speed winch. We're running a big set of Mickey Thompson MTZ tyres on Mickey Thompson's side-biter rims. Now although these tyres have only been on a little while, we've really given them a good test when we were up at LD Station and had some fun out on the rocks and the sand. We've got a set of the Narva 225 HRD driving lights along with Narva headlight inserts so we can see where we're going around town. Now the suspension is a 5 inch lift comprising EFS springs and long travel big bore shocks accompanied by superior engineering superflex radius arms, heavy duty steering links, and heavy duty rear control arms. Now, even though this is a pretty big lift, it's all been engineered for on-road use. It flexes great, and it still handles very well. Brown Davis have made a custom set of sliders for us. Piranha have installed one of their legendary Superloom systems, 
and of course we've got a Piranha dual battery system. We obviously run ARB diff locks front and rear to get us where we want to go. And out the back we've got a Black Widow drawer system, fridge slide and cargo barrier. And to keep us fed while we're out and about we've got that 12 volt travel buddy oven. I'm really happy with how the vehicle's turned out. It's come a long way in the last few months. Now it is still our touring vehicle, but it is set up now to tackle some more extreme tracks. Danny and I continue to play, let's head for a short break. We'll see you real soon.